Wilcox is going to. <laughs> Trey Wilcox is here with Trey Wilcox Cooking Concepts, which is in Plano. How you yeah, doing? It's doing really well. So you, you do cooking classes and then have this huge event space as well. Yeah, totally. A lot of different private events, you know. Right. Corporate team buildings doing really well, but I mean... Tis the season is coming up. You want to plan a party? You need team to building. You you put a you put a bunch of accountants in front of like mm. hot boiling water I and do. stuff. I do. You know, <laughs> make them work together. Come up with a dish together. I love that. It's idea. a great way to build a team. You know. Um, but the event space is doing really well, and I know everyone's getting back to the, the norm of the school mm. and right. the holiday season's coming up. So, this is one of the recipes that I actually cook for myself because oh. I mean it's getting busy. I love to work out, but mm -hmm. I, I can't just live off protein. Right. Protein shakes that is. Mm -hmm. Those metabolize too fast. So one of the biggest things I think people have a big problem with is figuring out how do I make the chicken taste good. Right. You know? Yes. And so this marinade is key. Right here you take cilantro, garlic, shallots, lots of jalapeno, a little bit of canola oil. Okay. Put it in a food processor and that's your marinade. After you make that marinade, it looks like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then you just want to put it in Ziploc bags, you know? See the Ziploc bag oh, yeah. labeled Yeah, this chicken. is how I do, this is how you I know? do my marinade. This is what real meal prep looks like because then when you want to eat something, it doesn't take like blah, it's just right. so boring, you know? So yeah, How long do you do chicken? That's, that's I never know. That's a great know. question. We, I marinate chicken for three days at, you know, Oh, really, that because long? Because huh. it's just getting good, you know? It's just becoming better. The flavor oh, and it also it tenderizes. It, it just has much, much more flavor right. and it will not go bad. Okay. So asparagus is one of my favorite vegetables. That's what I'm using as well. Um, jicama, that's something a lot of people don't worry, don't know about and that's what I was cutting up earlier. It's kind of a root or is it more like yeah. a potato? Like a Mexican potato. Okay. okay. It's, got, it's, got, it's really high in vitamin C. Okay. And it's really good. It's really low in carbs as well, too. And you grill it. And I do grill it. I grill the asparagus. I grill the jicama. If you want to add sweet potato to this, you can. Oh, as you can see, the good. chicken takes on a little bit of a green tint to it. And I feel like that's just one of those dishes that, yeah. you know, it still looks very, like, healthy. Mm -hmm. But it's got tons of flavor. Right. So that's what I'm really going to be looking for in these chefs that I got coming into my space. Yeah, there's a little competition coming up. You got a couple of your chef friends coming in. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I this got is great. So it's north versus south. So it's a smackdown, you Yo. know. The smackdown <laughs> concept would always change, but this first one I'm actually going to do north versus south. I'm going to take a chef that's based in nor the North Collin County area, mm -hmm. which is Jeff Moschetti from Jasper's, okay. and I'm going to put him up against Oliver from Blind Butcher. Oliver Citrons and Blind Butcher, one of my closest friends, so we're going to put them together. In Dallas. He's in right, Dallas. Okay. He's a South <laughs> Chef. Then we're going to figure out kind of which side of 635 has it better. Uh-oh. So <laughs> this, this SmackDown, you can buy tickets on my website, TreyWilcox.com. It's on October 16th. Yep. It's a Sunday, so it's an easy drive up north if you live nice. down south, which mm -hmm. is now Dallas to me. <laughs> I live in Plano, so down south yep. is Dallas, and I think it'll be an awesome competition. It's like, here's a mystery basket. Love you, it. you two go at it. I got the mayor of Plano as my judge. Uh -oh. <laughs> I mean, oh, he's geez. a foodie. Yeah. <laughs> That's so we'll, fun. we'll put more information about that smackdown as it's being referred to October 16th. That's at 3 p.m. You can find uh, the recipe and a link to more details about the event space as well on our website. <laughs> All right. And we've got some music coming your way straight ahead.